Hello everyone and welcome to today's ERA Military Collectible. So today's video, uh, we're in Ireland, kind of always expected it, but when we're going to try and do this, we're testing the 24 hour ration pack. Uh, I went for a bit of a walk today, Ireland being Ireland, I was expecting nice sun, stuff like that, that the video would go nice and well, but we're dealing with what we have. Up the hexi cooker, and we're going to try this in the Russian pack, and we're going to see how we get on. Right, guys. So obviously today's weather conditions were a bit inclement, shall we say? So what well, I have the trench here lighted, lit, and uh, I'm just going to put some water on it now for it to boil, and then we'll try the meat block which comes in the Russian pack. I'll just go get my instructions. Yeah, so we will try the meat block that comes in the ration pack um, and then we will try the oatmeal and then when we get back to warmer climates we'll possibly try the tea. So I'm just opening the meat block out of the ration pack. Uh, I'm trying to keep the wrapper because I'll probably repack it to put it back into the ration pack with something else. So I definitely can definitely taste or smell the, the meat off it. So, uh, what it says in the instructions is to break this up uh, with a half inch of water, which I will do, and then we'll just bring it to the boil. So I get back to you once I have. We can actually smell it. It is very salty, but uh, that's expected with a ration pack to put the um, energy that you've lost back into your body. Um, but yeah, then we'll get the clue there. It is what it says on the tin, it's a meat block, it's a ration pack. But yeah, so far so good, big thumbs up. The oatmeal block, um, same thing again as the uh, meat block, break it up and uh, stir it in about a half inch of water, and that's what we're going to do. What we will do then with the tea and the chocolate and stuff like that is we'll wait till we get back to drier conditions and less inclement conditions, and uh, we'll see what a nice cup of tea in the heat and what a big piece of chocolate feels like. So now that we're back in drier conditions, um, kettle is boiling as you can hear. Uh, biscuit, we're going to try the biscuits. We're going to make a cup of tea and we're going to try some chocolate. Biscuits are nice. Sweet biscuit as well. I don't know what to describe them as, they're not a rich tea. 
they're not a digestive neither. Um, yeah, they're interesting. I, I, I don't know what to compare the taste of them to. Nice biscuit look. Let's see what they're like when they're drunk. Now, we'll grab a piece of chocolate. So yeah, so we're going to try the chocolate here now. Um, I think this is a raisin one, possibly. And we'll see what this is like. There's a vitamin and rich chocolate as well. So yeah, quite nice. Very dark type of chocolate. Quite nice pine cocoa. Get yeah, a massive energy back off of that now. Yeah, that's the chocolate. So far with this whole ration pack, it's a massive thumbs up for me. If you want to get this ration pack, um, you can source it at Living History UK. Uh, I will put a link at the bottom of this video. But yeah, Steve Davis, you get these ration packs off at Living History UK. He's not a company, it's a standalone organisation. Whatever he makes off the ration packs, he puts back into the uh, his TikTok channel, YouTube channel, podcast, things like that. But yeah, so I'm going to boil the kettle, I'm going to have a cup of tea, and I'll check back in with you in a few seconds. So, we're back now with the tea. Um, it's two parts of these for a pint. I don't have a pint, but my steel mug. But, um, so... Oh, sorry, is it, yeah, it's four, I think, isn't it? But, uh, sure, we'll put them in anyone, we'll find out. And we'll see how it goes. Now, this has sugar and milk already in it, or whitener already in it. So, we just said the water will stir, and we'll see how we get in. Um, it is made of tea leaves, I believe. So, right, so, here's the tea made. Give it an old dunk. Into a biscuit. Yeah, the biscuits are nice, but I'm not sure what to compare them to. Tea is exactly what it says on the tin. Whitened, pre whitened, pre sweetened, um, very sweet tea though, but pre whitened, pre sweet tea. So, I cannot give this product a, a better thumbs up in relation to representation, authenticity, something like that. Um, if you do want to get the ration pack, uh, which is here, if you do want to get a ration pack, it's on Living History UK. Uh, I will put a link in the description below of where you can get it. But as I said, big thumbs up and thank you for Steve for um, giving me the opportunity to do this um, video on his product. Thank you. Mm -hmm.